A lot can happen from right now to the playoffs. A lot. The NBA does not look remotely the same in early February as it looks like in April, especially not in May and especially not in June. Injuries, trade demands, locker room drama, changing of coaches. The windows are always opening up for new things to come. But where we stand right now, the league has one team. One team levitating above the rest. The first seeded Boston Celtics, without Jalen Brown, beat a healthy, high expectation, second seeded Memphis Grizzlies team by double digits tonight. A contending team with high expectations lost to a one star down, one star down juggernaut of a team. And you know what the story is? Has nothing to do with the Memphis Grizzlies. The story is the Boston Celtics happen to be, as we stand in February, the team to beat. They're the team to beat. In 2023, what does a championship team even need, right? Let's, let's, let's just humor me for a second. Let's brainstorm this little, little brainstorming session, right? What are the key characteristics of a championship team in 2023 to you? I think first would be playoff experience. Well, in the last six years, this Boston Celtics squad has been, to four, has been at the least to four conference finals. In the last six years, this team has been one of the last four teams remaining. Last year, they made it to the NBA Finals. <laughs> so first is familiarity with playing on the big stage and getting comfortable with that tick. Next would be a defensive center. I think this is very underrated. A lockdown, paint defending, guard switching, shot blocking, big dude is absolutely one of the most underrated roles in the NBA. Kevon Looney. Kevon Looney is, he was pivotal to the Warriors last year. Uh, setting screens, not needing the ball on offense. The, uh, this idea of, you know, the big guy dominating the NBA, just destroying teams. It, it, in most cases, yeah, it is a bit of an outdated relic. It's a relic of the past. But the value of a defensive first center is absolutely fundamental to a system. And guess what? Systems win championships. Playing within a system wins championships. They have this guy in Robert Williams. Like I said, things change from February to April. And for Rob Williams' case, we're hoping he's healthy because health is a big is, is one of those things that changes. Now, they obviously got the talent, a superstar wing in Jason Tatum. And correct me if I'm wrong, but for the last 10 years, what? Has that not been the formula for winning NBA championships? A LeBron James, a Kawhi Leonard, a Kevin Durant. Big guys, big bodies, willing passes, excellent scorers, excellent scorers. They prove they have the depth. They prove they have the three. They prove they have the chemistry. I mean, they, they, I keep looking at all these squads around the NBA. I'm, I'm saying to myself, wow, man, I'm like, the Boston Celtics, it's their championship to lose. The Boston Celtics are the teams who beat in the NBA. Like and subscribe for more content. One.